okay so before you click off the video at least like and subscribe because i i'm i want subscribers and likes whatever squirrel is very strong how strong we will see in this video and just stay and watch it to see how strong she is because it's very interesting she's very interesting in terms of power okay so don't make her name and her appearance fool you she's no push over okay let's get that out of the way she's no joke she probably is a quirky girl but she, she is no joke in terms of fighting squirrel is a superhero that has the powers of a well squirrel what did you expect it uh, she has the, the strength of a human sized squirrel uh, she has a very cute tail and she can talk to shockingly squirrels. She can fight or beat people like Rhino, Mordak, uh, Mordok or whatever you want to call him or Craven, the hunter. She can casually beat or fight those people and those people are fighting people like Spider-Man, the Daredevil or Luke Cage so you know that's impressive. Uh, basically, Wolverine challenged her to, uh, to show him her skills and she beat him with little difficulty. She even turned her back at him and then he puts her in an arm hold but she calls for her squirrels to help her making Wolverine letting her go. Deadpool also got beaten by her just to know that. Uh, she defeated a 30 foot dragon. 30 feet dragon whatever uh, so yeah she defeated a freaking dragon okay but does nothing for her because she also defeated Dr. Doom Dr. Doom who can fight casually the Fantastic Four got embarrassed by Squirrel Girl and this is nothing yet she defeated Mordo a character that can fight Dr. Strange who is one of the strongest Avengers, Doctor Strange, the strongest or one of the strongest magic users in the universe, got gets defeated by Mordo sometimes, and Squirrel Girl beated him. In fact, Doctor Strange sometimes needs the Avengers to fight him, and Squirrel Girl not just defeated Mordo, he banished Mordo, he banished him, it's crazy. This is just the beginning because she took down Ego the living freaking planet. How did she beat a planet? I don't know but I know she did it. Korvac is a character that was barely, barely defeated by the freaking Avengers and Guardians of the Galaxy together and he didn't manage to win against my girl square girl i keep talking about the avengers in the video for the last minute but the truth is that she beat them as well she effed them up very hard and yes that was a clone of her but her clone has the exact same powers that she has so it's basically the same thing uh in an edition of her comic, she even makes Galactus not eat Earth by herself. They basically become friends and Galactus even tells her that if she ever wants to be his herald, she can be. And that's crazy because we know that Galactus doesn't really go and do that to anybody. But she, he proposed her to be his herald. And just imagine how strong she would be. She's already way above a lot of people at least on earth just think about that plus a fraction of the power of galactus she would be the strongest herald most probably uh, probably i don't know she would rival hulk because hulk was his herald i think one time and i think it was that one of when superman was his herald but i don't i don't remember if uh, it's surely not canon, but I don't know. I don't remember if he was actually his herald, or is just I don't remember good. But yeah, she would have been one of the strongest heralds. Uh, her biggest and most important feat, though, is defeating 
who yes Thanos uh, this is a famous thing that happened so basically square girl beated Thanos off panel she made him she she made him I don't know how to put it he will when when we see him he's just lying on the ground it's just embarrassing Thanos can casually fight people like Hulk Thor the Silver Surfer uh, people who can be scaled from planetary to star to galaxy level and he even produce some uh, damage to people like Galactus or Odin who can destroy the universe just by fighting so Thanos is this guy who can uh, probably destroy galaxies probably destroy planets probably destroy I mean probably destroy planets probably destroy uh, you know stars solar systems um, fight those people that can destroy universes of course he didn't won against those people but he could give them some damage he could produce some damage to them and then Squirgle comes and he beats him off panel remember that Thanos defeated the Avengers with no problem in many occasions and not just the Avengers a lot of people a lot Avengers plus other teams of superheroes were nothing to Thanos and Squirgle defeated him off panel in conclusion Squirgle is probably one of if not even the strongest hero at least on earth in Marvel comics she's just overpowered and of course she's a gag character she wasn't supposed to be taken seriously she isn't like Saitama. Saitama is a parody ca uh, character, which I will cover uh, in a later video probably. But she's a completely gag character. You can't beat her. And if you can, it's just in a very serious thing. Like, I don't know, if Thanos has the Infinity Gauntlet, then he can beat her. But she doesn't appear in serious uh, fights, I guess. But if she would appear like if something like... Uh, for example, in an uh, Infinity War storyline, when somebody with the Power Stone struggles against her, like uh, <laughs> that would be crazy, to be honest. But uh, anyway, yeah. Again, the conclusion is that Squirrel is probably one of the most, if not the most, powerful uh, hero uh, in Marvel. And that's kind of it. Uh, I know people don't like her, but I love her and. Uh, that's kind of it. Um, see you in the next video. I feel like on the internet somewhere it's a joke about Square Girl and No Not November. I can't just find it, but I'm pretty sure there is. Now the question is, which is the worst for her because she's a squirrel, or for you because you you know.